Um, but those are definitely fuel to our fire to why, you know, many of our guys are still playing in this game. You know, a lot of our guys, well, really nobody opted out. You know, we took this opportunity and embraced it um, and used it as fire for us to go out and, and play in this game. Oh, 100%. You know, Coach Golden is one of those guys that um, he helped me so much. And that's one of the main reasons why I came to Alabama, um, was to be coached by the best, was to be coached by, you know, one of the smartest guys in the game. And, of course, Coach Saban. But Coach Golden does a great job. Um, people love him. He's a people's person. And I think his knowledge of football would take him a long way. But, you know, if I was a player and Coach Golden was a head coach, I'd be down to play on this team. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, I just, you know, three days, I ate Popeye's chicken three days in a row. Like, I ain't never had, like, I've had, you got, we got Popeye's everywhere, but Popeye's in Louisiana, where it's from, like, it's unbeaten. I love it. I had, so if I had to say it had to be fried chicken Popeye's, had to be Popeye's. Yeah, um, you know, he's such a smart player. He's so young and smart, you know. Um, you know, he was a great high school player. I knew him, you know, throughout his high school career and knew what great player he was. Um, but I think he, the main thing that separates Sean from a lot of different players and a lot of freshmen has to be his knowledge of the game. Um, he's so smart about it. He knows what an offense is going to run just by, you know, simply the formation that they're in. Um, and I think he does a great job of embracing the coach and, and, and the coaching from the coaches and the coaches from the players. So that's what makes him so good. Ah, uh, you know, I think all of them, you know, I, I'm so much older than all of them. You know, we have a lot of sophomores and freshmen in there, um, but I see they're all different. We're all different, but they all have their, their game in them. But I think the one that, that reminds me of myself has to be Sean Murphy. It's got to be Sean Murphy. I know you only had a couple practices with him, but what have you seen from Dustin Jefferson and uh, just what, yeah. what do you think he's going to offer next year? He, he's so fast, like. I met him when he came to the camp. He, they said he ran like a 4-4, and I was like, golly. I like a linebacker running a 4-4, but he's so fast, so physical. You know, we threw him in the scrimmage. We had a scrimmage over the break, and, um, you know, he was in there hitting stuff. So, you know, he's from Memphis, and, and they, they put some good ball down there. How, much, how beneficial is it to have to bring in a guy that's already played two years of college football with how complex this defense is? Yeah. How, how big is that going to be for him? Um, that's going to be huge, and I think the biggest thing for him will be just embracing the culture and embracing, you know, the the – the stress that comes with being here at Alabama. Um, but he's a great player, and I think he'll, he'll do a great job with that.